came here like, what is it? It's about to be like 21 years or something like that. You know, came here to this place, to this planet or whatever. And it, it seemed like it was going to be cool cities, and whatnot, you know. Streets, but um, and laws are needed at every level. shit got so real fucked up, like, at the beginning. Like, like, once I got here, I saw how everybody else was, like, dressing and stuff like that. And I mean, like, it just seemed like what I was bringing to the table was not really appreciated and stuff. So people was just, like, automatically dissing me and stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? Like... Fortunately, I met this really cool dude, though. I met this really cool dude, and his name is Sonny. So, he gave me this little gig or whatnot, you know? So, like, he gave me this, like, wig, and he was like, yo, you know, you need to, like, I don't know what the hell is going on with your dress style. And, you know, at first I was like, no, whatever, you know, this is me. I'm peaceful and, you know, peace and, and stuff like that. But... He was like, nah, that's not even cool, you know, because like people, people love this right here. So I was like, shit, you know, I'm gonna be here for a while, so I need to go ahead and be smart about it, you know, I need to go ahead and survive and shit. So he gave me the wig and whatnot. He like put me in a couple of music videos. So yeah, so anyway, so after a while, I just like, I moved in with like these guys and I was living in like this little shack. And so uh, I was like, all right, this is cool, whatever, blah, blah, blah. You know, I'm still, I'm still living there. They all right, they cool, but it's like, I don't know. I'm like, I, I don't see why it gotta be so hard. Cause like where I'm from, this is where I live at. Hi, how are you yet? <laughs> So yeah, so like, you know, my uncles, my aunties, my mama, my daddy, all them, you know what I'm saying? They chilling back at home and they like, you know, they always trying to phone me up and stuff like that. And, you know, try to ask me what's up and stuff like that. And it's like, I don't want to tell them that. Many people have lost their nationhood. Many people have been conquered. Many people have been abused, and yet our laws are singularly the greatest laws of any people in human history. Our laws were so great that it was difficult for us to recover because we lost self-confidence and we lost the image of the world as we had previously conceived the world. I don't know, like, I gotta just keep talking to you, you know what I'm saying, or else I'm gonna go crazy, cause, you know, like, write to me, like, just tell me, cause I can't afford no, uh, I can't afford no doctor, I can't afford what they call a shrink or whatever, I can't afford that, so, like, y'all gonna have to, like, help me out or something, because I can't take it no more, and like really, I can't wait to go back home. Like, I'm from Panfrica, and it's like a whole nother, it's similar to here, but it's like, it's so much Who happier. Like, I don't, they got all Who these different terms, and all these different like head. angry people that look Who like me here, and I'm just wondering why they angry. And then like, the trances that I go into, like, I'd be so confused, I'd be like, well, I kind of understand, but then I'm like scared, and then I'm like hurt, and then I'm like angry. But it's like, you know what I'm saying? Like, y'all gotta help me interpret what the hell is going on. Like, I don't know. I don't know what's going on. You know what I'm saying? Like, like if you can help me try to understand, you know what I'm saying? Like, tell me what, where I need to go to get more understanding. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't know.